presented to Nigerians for a new direction. I am not in this place for a show, but I'm here to declare to you what God has shown to me. The year 2019 is going to be a year of judgment of God and favor for Nigeria. Yeah. Write it down, it's two things. Judgment of God and favor. Great flood of trouble for those that have been troubling our country and put our children, our fathers and mothers into pain in its life. That judgment is coming in 2019. Yeah. In the midst of this judgment, they shall be faithful. In the midst of this flood, they shall be good news. And that good news cannot come from anywhere but God. Down through the stream of years of existence of this country, there has been Nigeria and gathering together to elect the president. But 2019 is a year that God will elect the president by himself. Mark what I say to you. And God is getting ready to raise a youth that will carry his purpose. But the Bible says that God rules in the face of man. And to whomever he wills, he puts to lead his people. Nigeria is not a wayward country. It was planted by God. And I'm declaring what God has shown to me. That 2019, after all is said and done, you will remember this day that God will bring to us and show to us a Messiah. Yeah. And that Messiah is in the midst of us. Yeah. And I'm going to pray and pray for him that the counsel of God for this country be fulfilled. Yeah. The plans of the wicked ones in the high places, they that has vowed that they will not line with the power of God, it shall be aborted. Yeah. I open this meeting today as we gather about in the name of Jesus. Amen. I declare that the Father in his own infinite wisdom will give his son whom he has appointed to lead us to the promised land. Amen. Unusual wisdom, unusual understanding, Amen. unusual protection. Amen. A protection that cannot be understood by human physical ability. That is given to our own excellence president whom the lord has appointed for this generation Amen. father god as we gather in this place i ask that your spirit rest upon us Amen. open the eyes of the understanding of your people to know your will and to know your mind and not to be deceived again by the kankawams and pamawams who have been leading us wrongly open your heart to line up with your wisdom and your vision for this country and I'm thanking you at the end of the day that 2019 your will shall be performed Amen. your will shall be performed Amen. your will shall be performed Amen. in the name of Jesus Amen. father I'm trusting in you for you to do your wonders Amen. it is not by might nor our power that Showare will rule us it shall be by your power and your wisdom it shall be by your own understanding Amen. for the foolishness of God is wiser than the wisdom of men it has not been shown and come clear to Nigerians yet but I believe you have a way of doing your own thing when people thought that Hillary Clinton and Obama was getting ready to take over US I stood and prophesied what you showed to me that Donald Trump was the president and everyone in our church and various places they say he was prophesying rubbish. I told them that it's Donald Trump the Lord showed me for I was taken and caught up in heaven and God showed me how Donald Trump was chosen by God to lead that country for the last grace for the country. And in the same way that you have shown me that there is no other will for this country than a youth. I was taken to heaven, God showed me that is the youth that will rule this country. Yeah. And I have come to announce to Nigeria, forget about those that are deceiving you. The plan of the Father God for this country is the youth. Yeah. And I'm declaring that there is no power. There is no power, even though the entire Africa stand, join together and come together, they cannot stop the purpose of God for Nigeria. Yeah. God has already predestined for a youth to take us to the promised land. Yeah. And I thank you, Father, because you will bring it to pass what you have said. You will make it good. We depend on you. 
We have no power of our own, but you can do it. You can turn it around. If you do it for drums, you will do it for sure, right? I say, God, if you do it for drums, did it for drums, you will do it for sure, right? Trump had nobody, but you became somebody for him. Sure, it has nobody, but great God Jehovah is his backing. God of him is mightier than any other person. And I'm thanking you because you will turn things around. At the nick of time, Lord, you will turn things around. Thank you for what you're getting ready to do. Nigeria, hear me. The Lord is going to smile on you. 2019, the Lord is going to smile on you. All the broken pieces of our country shall be put together again. Amen. Thank you, Lord, for what you are able to do. May your name be glorified in Jesus' name. Amen. Okay, let's be seated, please. Yeah. I want to use this opportunity to call some, some of our leaders to the high table. Um, we have Prophet Victor James. Uh, what I call the name is Victor. And uh, I want to call on uh, Honorable Wadutan to come to the high table. I want to call on uh, Honorable Ade Yemi Adesheye. And uh, Honorable Bankole from Agege Local Government. AAC. Shomore for President. AAC. We have our father, uh, Baba Seventy. Uh, Mr. CK Akintola. Honorable President. President. And uh, we have one of our women leaders in our midst, Alaja Fatima Bello. And uh, we have uh, uh, some local government coordinators uh, in our midst. I, if I call you, I, we, I want just I want you to stand up for recognition and. Uh, if the, the high table like permit, I want to, before I go further, please. <clears throat> and as you are coming, look at government coordinators, please come with your share so that you come up here. Yeah, we have uh, the coordinator for Alimo Shaw, Elijah. <clears throat> Where is she? Uh, I have the man. Okay. Okay, Elijah, please. We have uh, uh, the coordinator for Shomolu. Shomolu local government. Just raise up your hand, please. And come, come, come with you. And uh, the coordinator for Ifako Jaye. It's on this way. Uh, I get the way. Uh, okay. We have uh, our father, CK. She, he is already on seat. And uh, the coordinator for our uh, Agege 
we have uh, one Mr. Coordinator for Agege, Elijah, where's the other man? Sulaiman. Well, we are not going to waste our time because uh, we can just, okay, uh, and, uh, Mrs. Simbaka, please. Please, uh, we the coordinator for Lagos Island. Is it? Is it Aaron? It's coming. Okay. Okay. We don't want to waste our time. Uh, the reason why we are here, I think uh, we all know. Hmm? Okay, yeah, I'm very sorry. We have one of our women leader here. He's from uh, uh, Ikeja, but he's working in uh, both uh, Kusofe and Ikeja together. And uh, Mrs. Uh, Bo Abosebe, that's Nguru. The president of the AMC Sabo Ojudu Bega local government. We have uh, one of our young lady, uh, Elijah uh, Ganias. Just, just. Yes. I cannot uh, without recognize one of our uh, dignity here, although he's our family, the family of the president, but I must mention his name. Mr. Robert Shure. Yeah. We'll be mentioning our people as, as they are coming in. We have, a, I'm sorry, we have a one Eda Shegun Ogunkoya from Shomolu local government. Come to the high school, sir. Now, I, I don't have much job today. Uh, the president himself, the president to be himself is around. We want to hear from him. And uh, he has uh, other programs somewhere. And he even called, called me yesterday that uh, we should let our own uh, be around uh, 4 o'clock because a lot of people want to see him. But uh, I told him that, uh, ah, people of, uh, this, this some people will be very, very bitter with me. So that is the reason why he's here. Uh, I want to, I want us to hear from him, and uh, he will tell you about his program for Nigeria, for good people of Nigeria. And if there's any question, you can ask. And uh, I don't want our question because uh, the more the question, the more delay. So I want our question to be very brief and moderate. So I want to hand over to the mic to our president to be Ishallah, the candidate of uh, African Action Congress, uh, a person of a uh, comrade. I call him comrade, uh, comrade Omoyele Shure. Give him a round of applause. I want to thank uh, my big brother here who has not introduced himself. This is Elder Shegun Shore. And uh, something is very important that I must say before I commence my speech. He was the one who brought me to Lagos from Ondo State. Around 1987, and we came and stopped at Ojodu. So my journey in Lagos started from this Ojodu. Wow. Yes. We're living 
we can't even call it a room. We're living at the back of a house, somewhere in Ujudu here. I was from there that I went to the University of Lagos and went to the rest of the world. I started from here. I want to congratulate all of you, both Christians, Muslims, and those who may not even believe in any particular religion, but everybody worships something in Nigeria. The congratulation is that finally Nigeria is about to turn the corner. That's right. And uh, some things are happening in Nigeria right now that is pointing to a generational change. A bunch of leaders who are old are dropping dead. We are not the ones killing them. It's the design of nature so that Nigeria can share the self of the load of the past so that Nigeria can experience progress and prosperity. Nigeria should have one of the best countries in the world, but human beings deliberately head the destiny of Nigeria to ransom. The way to describe it is that Nigeria was kidnapped by our leaders, the people we call our leaders now. And even after we pay the ransom, they refuse to release Nigeria. So we have reached a point where we are saying enough is enough. And we are rescuing our destinies from these leaders. And the ones that will not let it go, Nigeria will let them go. The ones that will not leave Nigeria alone, Nigeria will leave them alone. That is where we are. Because I cannot imagine 200 million people who could have been the happiest in the world but are the saddest in the world. One fee or one one Kamale ni lo siwaju emi ti mo nba yin soro yi mo wa si ilu yi ni ojodo in 1987 ni mo wa si ba yi mi o ni baba mi o lalati le yi egbon mi lo mu mi wa segun se ore in 1987 amo be lu gbogbo ba sese titi titi asa ni lo siwaju ati de gbogbo agbaye on la se pada wa pe I would not need lost what you need to do. I want to do what I buy. For soon, control what I need. I want a boomerang nearby to see Nigeria. So, Runi, I bought Johnny. Show me La Fenny. I'll be on Jet. I'm more. I want to want to want to do really day. Lati B or a big Lati a barrel to say in the not in shape. Shuka, Shuka, Bashu, Bashu. Ti won je ka ni lo siwaju idi yen la wa se ni pe awa duro lati gba orilede wa pada won ti reverend wa nso ni eleko yen kon ti won pe nkan ton so ni oyebo ti won ti e ni pe o do lo le se ba pada ka gba orilede wa pada lawo awon ti won ti bi orilede wa ton fi gba pa ro what I want to say once again is that it is completely possible to have a Nigeria where people can wake up and go to school, send their children to school without any connection with anybody. It is possible to have a Nigeria where you can start a journey 
and you arrive at your destination safe. It is possible to have a Nigeria where you can be sick and you can see a doctor. It's possible. It's possible to have a Nigeria where you can get a job after you graduate from school. But look at Nigeria today, you send your child to school, primary school, secondary school, university, he will still be living with you after he finishes NYC. Is that the kind of country we should continue with? And the people they are presenting to us, they are the people who caused the problem in the first place. If you are around in 1983, Buhari was the president of Nigeria. You are around in 2019, Buhari will still be the president of Nigeria. If you are around in 1992, you know Atiku. If you are around in 2019, you still want Atiku to be president. And I refuse, since I started nine months ago, there's nobody who didn't advise me to go and see Obasanjo. I said, my destiny is not in Obasanjo's house. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Nobody hasn't advised me to go and see Tinubu. I said, Tinubu came to Lagos the same way I came to Lagos. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Tinubu is from Iraqbiji and from all those states. Why should an Iraqbiji man be the lord of a person in Lagos. Why should he be holding the land and future of people of Lagos to ransom? They asked me to go and see Babangida. I said, even if he dies, I will not attend his burial. Because they are the ones who delayed the progress we are supposed to have since 1993. The place we are now, we are supposed to be there in 1993, we would have made progress past this period, but it did not allow it to happen. But today is not to blame the leaders. I want us to have a moment of truth. We have to blame ourselves too. We have been too docile. We have been too complacent. And in some regards, we are complicit in the condition that we are, we are suffering today. Need <laughs> As going on, so we are activists. Our fate, our share job, our own. That is so funny. Tell me, we are conscious, we are conscious. Our no, we are shaking. We are the bush in Turi led. The shining book bag by it. As I'm walking around the world, I don't compare Nigeria with Europe and America again. Let's start comparing Nigeria with African countries. We were at Mowasi by 1987. I want Ghanaians to tap off Now, I want Nigerians to tap off puff in Ghana. And you just say Ghana must go. In 1983, Nigeria must go. Who wants to go far? At the point, I want Ghana. On the side, I won't share Iran no more. That is the part where I'm blaming us. Other people found on Luri to let she Luan Kodara. The bad Degana Lini Luanda. Ni Lui and Romo lost Leeway, ni Benny Republic, Latin Law University. The Toribe University wow, she law. She got a machine lay on 2019 here. I want to stop when you go shake, shake, kill with Dara. Go shake, shake, and then you go to no more. Do you pay? I want only my confusion. You pay? Ah, the bash up for a lot of merry see. And as you go down more, you run the one path for you. In 1977, you got down on parents who are done very lost in first start. Uncle Wajo. Oh, I saw who are you are the leaders of tomorrow. That's 1977. Forty the forty seven years old me my D to my marry tomorrow. But we are the back part of the Mafidila or Joke is Yama the leaders of tomorrow. And when Ton She Minister of Agriculture in nineteen seventy nine, how do Obe our call social studies? Then two thousand and nineteen that the Minister of Agriculture, how do Obe? Only let the Unicorn, only let the Dubai book back by ye to Jacque. 
are a real Jew, Nigeria, 58 years old. Buhari, 78 years old. Our ancestors were known to Lori Wa. Whatever will go back or really the top of the loss of our door. The one year Latin chair or Lori Lidder, they were France, they were Canada. America, in fact, Obama, the president of America, he was 46 to 47 years old. In fact, Bill Clinton, the president, he was 46 to 47 years old. Everybody will let you know what you lost. You are not back with meeting or Tony continue some meeting or Tony continue to have a ball. Tony, it's in Dumba. Or Tony got on bail away, or Tony got on down. I wish I could not have a little share election to be she was so for me to pay on better and then we see the Tory a cotilator name at the cool and it took the custom to Jacob Fire One or she if I don't know the bass or job fire to the she job fire job fire one on it no she I take it in one thing jolly in fact but the judge is on jet away, or more, we pay at equal lenny. Only a mob won't go to Jale more. Nigeria <laughs> Okay, Okay, I So, what have you paper, Lodun Tombo. Ebewa is in a Iketa Luri ballot paper, Lord Tombo, Presidency. Eva Shen Dibo, if it's a Mafikani city. A Kateba Fisibi by E. Nile welfare, found for him. A Kateba Fisibi by E. Nile welfare. It got about fifty by ye, me or no. To that gay to Mamma Lossy Louis. It got about fifty by ye, near railway. Latin me by ye, once you railway, you will do a little thing. You will turn in the Morocco, I've been told in Kenya, on in South Africa, to have with about Gila Rock, the Valen Losundo, and the Losundo said, Let me no job. Seventeen million homes landed in Louis, so that don't look like it. We don't wait on se ero ton se eyan bi mono mono amo ero mono mono e gbe te ba tonu te ma fi ji la rojo abi te ba lo pa no yin lo reku ina e ma ma ton e gbe wa o ma fun ilu wa ni 24000 megawatts of electricity within 2 years awa o se e gbe oni disco Egbati 
between 2016 and 2018, one share 14,000 megawatts of electricity in your alone 40 million, only no within two years. And more in Nigeria, PDP no 60 billion dollars. Lori Okunku, one we generate Okunku new, in not only to work on. On to on to bomb power on transformer. Any layer transformer from any layer to any any band no church in Nigeria. The band bury on Kolo alone. Oya to say on to no church in Ghana. But I'm bury on alone. Don't put the prayer point. Oya to say that one. To the bit of that thing bury no. I want Ghana bury good health from that one. To the one thing no. The band the Ghana because it contains a bomb hole. Ni bobo Ghana. Walking, wanting, walking, trip, bobo. Pure pipe bone water, the one name. I'm only Lua. Even the university gone on, 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 drill the bobo. University, on tap pure water. I'm going to I want Motoba lost leeway to leave Bawa. She lost leeway. To ba nje pe ijo ba run wa lowo emi o le dro wa ju yin leni ki ma soro mo se soro yi nigba ti mi lo si university of lagos ni 1989 40 dollars i mean 40 naira ni owo school fees 40 naira won go daddy mi o ni lowo ta wa ba dori oye o se pe a ma fun awon student ni eh school fees ko ni si school fees nigba ti wa amo Student to ban lost leave where my money hundred hundred thousand for study allowance per semester. Again, it is. What I'm saying, ladies and gentlemen, is that this is not a sloganeering matter. This is a moment of truth. Yes. Everything I'm saying to you today, go and record it down. All of us are part of history here today, if we do it right. That there was one day we sat under a small canopy, not at a stadium, because nobody is paid to come here to discuss how to change the direction of Nigeria and that you met a young man who said that it is possible for those of you who are Christians this is the moment of a David versus Goliath right. but the come most on, important on, thing on, is that the people of our country need to make a choice because the Pontius pilots are there yes. delivering Jesus under the table and washing their hands off but the people must decide not to choose Barabbas over Jesus that's right there's a moment for everybody with conscience they are going to line people up and say choose who you want go for Jesus don't go for Barabbas I am not comparing myself to Jesus I'm comparing this moment as a moment that you'll be confronted with on February 16 2019 you'll be asked with this ballot paper to choose whether you want to guarantee the future of your children or to choose whether you want to eat bread and those of you who are Christians too you know what happened to Israelites when they had to leave Egypt <clears throat> they had to tell them not to eat a kind of bread because if they are eating that bread it would have delayed their freedom we have already passed the borders of Egypt because Pharaoh is going to go down as pastor has said even Her Herod will die but we must not choose bread over our future so that we can have a celebration of Passover mm. at the end of it. Mm. I'm sure this will register for those of you who are Christians and even non-Christians. After you vote for this thing very well, there's a tactic they use. They want you to vote here. If you fold it over, your ink will go to PDP 
or APC. Yes. Don't fold it like that. Fold it backwards so that the ink will not go and stain. The way they design it is that when you fold it, you don't fold it. Your ink will now pour over that of APC or PDP, and you are not looking. When you leave, they will clean your finger, or they will outrightly reject the ballot paper so that the person who you voted for will not win the election. The other thing they are doing is that they are buying PVCs, which they will give to their own people. Make sure that when you get to the uh, ballot uh, uh, polling unit on that day, you vote and you stand by your vote. Forget about what they do with talks. They use talks to intimidate people. When they find nobody to intimidate, talk will leave because talk has one vote. Traditional ruler has one vote. Like Pastors have Rashid, only one vote as well. If you don't have a PVC, let everybody go and vote. Stand by their Nigeria. vote. If you have your cameras, forget about what INEC has said. Use your camera phone to film whatever is happening around you. Because the more of this evidence we have, the more we are able to present to the world on time who is the winner of the election. Buhari is not going to win the next election. Yeah. Yeah. They, they already know it. All these things they are doing, they are doing in the stadium all over this Ras Matas. It's not going to, they know it won't win them the election. Atiku is not going to win the election. They know it already. That is where you are here. That's why you are hearing Body George saying that yes, we know our candidate is a thief before before, but they know the thief anymore. They know that they have a bad product, and they know that Nigerians are wiser now. Yes, that we are smarter than before because we have made these mistakes before. Ladies and gentlemen, there was a time there was a chance to vote for Ganifa and me in this country. We voted for Basanjo. Look at what became of us. If Ghani had been president for just four years, he would have done better than all the APC and PDPs combined together, just for four years. But people said, ah, he's too activist. Uh, he's not diplomatic. He's not this. The diplomatic people you voted for, look at the Nigeria they created for you. They have diplomatized the treasury. <clears throat> the kidnappers you voted for, look at Nigeria, they created for you. Look at this man, Buhari, that was voted for in 2015. He has not done anything for Nigeria. I went to his hometown, Daura, I drove there, so that nobody is confused about my intention. I was surprised that these people are saying that, please, we are expecting the useless man to come back home. Make sure you tell other people not to vote for him. In his hometown, I have video of it, you can see it on Facebook. Nobody likes Buhari. The people who are following him, they are doing it for their own selfish interests. The Jagabans of this world, they are doing it for their own selfish interests. So the moment you bail yourself out of Buhari's hand, you have also bailed yourself out of Jagaban's hand. Because all of us, all of you deserve freedom. So our people, please open your eyes. But most importantly, tell everybody when you get back home. Because they tell us, oh, we don't know Shore. Well, now you know me and you have heard me. Please let the good news spread and spread very fast. Because bad news have been spreading for 58 years. If we have a chance to spread the good news in the next one and a half months, do it very, very quickly and very fast. I don't have money to give you. I will say it in advance. I don't have bread to give anybody. I don't have branded Akara to give anybody. But I have 10 programs. And I'll explain it very quickly. One, that every Nigerian will be secure in this country called Nigeria. Whether it's from kidnappers or Boko Haram or headsmen. Second, that I will provide electricity within the first four years to at least 60 million Nigerians. At least 60 million. 24,000 megawatts. Third, that I will double the infrastructure in the country. Everywhere you see a single road will be a dual carriageway. Fourth, that will fight corruption in three stages. 
prevention, enforcement, and consequences. So that we change our value system. That someone who is corrupt will not be walking around feeling that it is all right, and children thinking it's all right to be corrupt and to be hardworking. Four, that we'll create an economy that is empowering, that everybody that is looking for a job can at least find a job without knowing somebody. The same way I went to the university without knowing somebody. Thank you. Six, that we will do a restructuring of Nigeria. But our restructuring is not a restructuring prescribed by people who are hiding under restructuring because they want to support Article. It's a restructuring of our economy and a restructuring of our country in the interest of the future of the young people of Nigeria. And that in that process, we must be the arbiters of restructuring and not onlookers. Right? Number, I think we had number seven, is health. We will provide more 60,000 healthcare workers to go around Nigeria to ensure that even at the minimum, our people are getting their blood pressure tested, which most of us have never done before. That when we are sick, we get the help we need. We will introduce a head card. Every Nigeria will have that head card where you can call a doctor to help you. And we we'll use technology that even if the doctors to help you are not here, by telephone you can reach Nigerian doctors who want to help, who are outside but cannot come into the country because they have destroyed the country. Number eight is education. That there are 13 million children that must be taken back to school. Under our government, and I'm saying this and warning our mama and papa, it will be a crime not to send your child to school. In, in the place I live in America, if my daughter and son don't go to school, they will call me. The next day is the police that will come and arrest me. For not. Every child must be given a chance to go to education, I mean, to get education in Nigeria in our lifetime. It doesn't matter what they want to do with it. If they like, let them not go to use the degree for something. I had a degree in geography and planning. When I finished, I went and did journalism. It's not the degree that matters, but the brain development that happens from education. <laughs> Number nine is agriculture. That in this country, we must be able to grow enough food so that we don't go hungry. But how we need to do it is that instead of buying Prado jeeps for our governors, we should be buying tractors to till the land. So that everybody can grow whatever they want to eat first and also grow things that can be sold to do empowerment. In that regard, in every local government, we will empower at least a thousand persons to grow whatever can grow in their area. There are 20 million cows in Nigeria roaming around. That's why headsmen are killing people. We will create ranches for them, commercial ranches, not to seize your land to build a ranch, but to create an opportunity for them to put it in a ranch. Anybody that is now roaming around, law enforcement will take care of the problem. Nobody will have a right to kill another person you know, because of a cow. The life of a cow under our government cannot be more important in life than the life of a human being. Yes. Finally, is tourism. Nigeria is showing the world fantastic things to do with the brain power of culture and tourism, but there's no development. And without all the nine things that I mentioned to you, we cannot get our tourism work. Our music is already doing well, our movies are already doing well, but we don't have a government. So for the first time, Nigeria, we have a government of the people, by the people, and for the people. I'm not here to impress you. I'm here to challenge you. Now, like myself, everybody should be angry enough by now to say enough is enough, and that Nigeria must be pulled out of poverty so that we can experience rapid development, growth, prosperity, and by extension, peace. But it cannot be peace without social, economic, and political justice. That is why our party, African National Congress, was created three months ago. Our party is only three months old. 
but has become the most popular party in Nigeria today, three months ago. And I'll say one final thing to you. Somebody might be lying to you that Buhari is afraid of Atiku. They are not afraid of Atiku. They know how to take care of Atiku. They are afraid of the young people, the old people who are frustrated with them in this country. Let me break it down to you. There are 82 million voters now, 83 million voters, right now, registered to vote. Buhari is only able to boast of 10 million votes. So there are 50 million more votes left. And they have seen that most voters this time around came from Taraba, Benue, Plateau, South South, South East. Everybody that is dissatisfied with their style of leadership. That is why they shut down the registration of voters so that more angry voters are not registering. <laughs> Please understand that this is the most powerful time in your life as a voter. There are 50 million votes. Buhari might have maybe 10, Atiku probably 5 million. That's 15. We have 35 million votes out there to tap from. That is assuming that 20 million people don't vote. So look at the limitless opportunity we have to win this election by 12 noon, 12 noon on February 16, 2019, which coincidentally is my birthday. We, if we do it right, we have a brand new president that is imagined as a result of prophecy. And this time around, time-tested prophecy that the youth will emerge from Nigeria. And the moment he emerges and wins the election, Nigeria will experience a different direction. And Nigerians will be happy, you know, we will not be people who are happy by experimentation, but people who are happy, solidly happy people will be happy by substance. Thank you so much. President. You are. Now we want to allow some questions. At the board, not yet know our president to be. I don't think uh, we cannot do without asking questions because he said a lot. So we, but uh, let it be few. Okay and moderate. Yeah. Hey Joe, I Mike. Okay. AAC. Show for president. Show for president. Hey Joe, you don't joke with like it. That's my joke with you. I got you for president. You are one solo. On our joke, you did it. You don't know ndo <laughs> To ba je wi pe ngba ti awon asiwaju e ti won de be ni gba na ki won to de be la ba so fun won wi pe bible ni kon fi bura quran ni kon fi bura ogun gangan ni kon fi bura fun wa to ri pe ogun tete ma nja kini ri si ni ri pe ti won ba de be kan ti won ba dale eni ba dale a se kini ba dale no se wa iru joko ta joko ndi ile ni inu temi dun gan gidigidi mo wa fe President, 
I believe in Omo Yelisho Ure as a person. And the day I recognized that a friend of mine in Cosmic, whom we graduated together, the person of Adela Gabriel, happened to be part of this movement, I made up my mind that I will follow because I knew what it did while you were in the school. So I, respect, I celebrate you, Father. I celebrate you. Where is it? I celebrate you. Now, I want to ask a question. You, you've told us that, because um, I calculated it there, you said, the students will be getting 100,000 uh, education allowance. That is like 33,000 per month, because three months is a semester. I also want to ask, you said you are going to generate 24,000 megawatts for at least 60 million Nigerians. I want to also ask again, how do you intend to generate, because we know this country, the moment they know that they have lost an election, they will loot the treasury to the extent that it, will, it may be difficult for you to run these programs. So that it will not be like same of the same. Oh, Yare, he came here, he told us the same thing. And so that you will not come and be giving us an excuse that there was no money. They told us that they will not pay, uh, so that subsidy is a fraud. Now we are paying 1.4 trillion naira, and this, there's even the provision for it in the present budget at the house now. So we want to know. Are we sure that by the time you get there, because it's like most of us are only concerned on the presidency, ASC needs to infiltrate even in, in the House of Assembly, the House of Red, because even if we get the presidency and the other ones are not there, we see what is happening with the president between APC and PDP. So I want to know, is it that by the time you get there, you will not be giving all the same excuses that the treasury has been looted, there are no funds, there are this, there are that. Thank you. Thank you so much. My name is um, Abdul Rahman. My question, uh, I have just three questions, very briefly. The first one is, um, the House of Rep is uh, where we have the embodiment of corruption in this country. Please, when you get there, what will you do differently? Um, secondly, uh, what would you, uh, uh, we have a Boko Haram in this country, what would you do differently to stop the Boko Haram in so the, uh, Number three, uh, I'm a born and brought up, uh, as in, I'm born and brought up in Ojudu here, so and I, I've never met you for once. I, I want to know where you really um, reside way back here in Ojudu. Thank you. Change. But instead of change, 
Number 16, 
Yes. Uh, somebody asked about students and youths. Students, youth, what do we need most? We need education, and when you graduate, you need jobs. And that also extends to our elders. The African culture is the best culture when it comes to support for elders. Our parents in Ondo State, where I grew up, they have a lot of children. And one day I asked my dad, why are you having all these children that you cannot take care of? My, child, my father had up to 20 kids at the point, from three women. My father told me, he said, the government is no longer paying salaries. My children will become the social security for me in the future. When I train you, when I'm tired, you will come and support me. When we provide your children with education and they get jobs, they will come and support the elders. The support that our elders are getting is even better than the support that some elders are getting in America. In America, if you are staying with your child, they will be collecting food money from you. They don't have culture. If a child is staying with the father, the father will be collecting rent from his child. And yes, after you are 18 years old, they will drive you out of the house. Go and look for, go and look after yourself. But most importantly, there is also a design our program for the social security system. In the almost 60 years old, a job, a certain amount of money for allowance, that's my job. That's my loss, it was son. Then, by mirror, I'm a fool, that's a worker. I'll be put a buffet war and walk on to a job by year ten, so I had to see I want to jail more kekere. You want shin shin buba by in here. A more it took the wash up at a key to she cook tea meal tea suffering in the middle and some found one she share one. That eighteen thousand, they want some from federal workers in Nigeria. Once you increase it, thirty thousand. They have lost in South Africa, one twenty six thousand naira. They want some low shoe, found one she share. A bear AAC, Mama found one she share, new hundred thousand low shoe shoe. It did as a supper, new people. Ah, the supper, I wrote some found one she share one. Come as some fourteen million naira, found one senator too, King Lossy B. Share. Eh mo ye ti iyo dun ti o sise Nigeria ni lati sise lati gba 40 million ye ti senator gba lo shu te ba n gba 18 million lo shu eni lati sise fun 37 years ke to le gba 14 million ye ti senator gba lo shu kon won toju ara won won ni interest si wa ni ah fun awon students ah ore wa kon bere pe ba la se mamari 33 33000 son fun Nigerian students, Ejek Inshallah, Yefuyi, the Bawala in Niger Delta, the Bakwebon, then she militant, then we don't have Baloshu, one thirty five thousand Nara, each militant in Ba, ni Niger Delta, ni Amnesty, one she. So, all better Latin the militants, you can on just students in law in Nigeria. Ele, you should go on so I want your wife to be one year, and militant won't go on the one thirty-five thousand naira number no shoe London amnesty. Any country, any country, and don't borrow one. And when you don't win jail per day, fourteen thousand naira le le one win jail per day. Check for me. When you go on a coin, you buy one. I want to know don't coin in jail. Amo, he is in one costile. So all that kind of people lost their one to go lost their way in Nigeria. Amo. Anywhere ni go back by a tomb, but in Rome, money lay away, won't run lay one knee. It's the easiest way to send people to prison is not to send them to school. In fact, in Nigeria, she was lonely, open prison in Nigeria for our door. So, key one is at 33,000. 
for students to lose the way we give you a per month that are less than for you. So that LA concentrate this way with them law. La America, I'm not telling you America, I'm telling you kids from America after two years. One for many student loans. One for many grants. That is a master's for Dumeji. Me, I'm from America. I want to jump on Nigeria. Oh, we go back to one Panidi. We want to go to America. She, not to go to Britain. She, not to go to Netherlands. She, kilo de ta wa ole wa no wo ye suri arawa. I want to go to wa lo fa. And you come here in the House of Reps. We at the same time we want to go to the Jagru Gara Lo Ambe. O Tony. I'm more concerned about the integration of the Bofun. I go to the Bofun presidency. And the Bofun, I want to send it to the Lossi Senate and the Bofun House of Reps. I want you to look at that the Quara Ambi by the joint man be no more compared to the Lossi Quara. Quara State. Chat on your Quara State one Ambi. Uh huh. Chat the best man the Bofun was Sarakin Koko. He lend that one up right. I want you. I'm Robert. You want to share the most of the Jali Lofa. Uh huh. And my the Bofun one on your bed. You need to vote for. Representative, what are the most in the BAC? But a book go in the Yoruba, but while I'm a Moluabi, and the Bofa or Moluabi to a Larry, to a Larry, one lost in Senate, one lost out of rep, one lost in State of State House of Assembly. And the Sofu, you pay, get the Bofu, go pay, my pay, work on the Senate, on the bed, on Yari, go on to my Senate, she be a PC, you want, go on. But on the bed, it's a good jet. Okay, you see, I want so guarantee. Oh, see, we pay the body of our make back on the Dory Bay one in logo. We want to show you she want to have the bed. I'm more and got to what I want. I roll more. We want the man, she found senator. And if we are one senator, you bad. Do you want to say? Oh, also, I'm all say she. The Bafari Gap, Senator, to represent me, represent me. Only in Kotokonwa, the new constitution, I don't quite need to call. So, I pull up on Noloa. That's the way I want to represent you on your Moloabi, La Riarai. You're competing for Boko Haram, Boko Haram, Boko Haram, Boko Haram, Mimi Tiso, and Bomi. I want army generals who are new. Thank you, Boko Haram, Boko Lurile Dewa. One fee or Boko Haram, one fee shaking, one fee in Chen. I want to talk about the bed. Who can one general in La Maritaya? But it was a Padaki Junipe, editor general commander in chief of the armed forces, Lenny Baba Buhari Baba Mokotun She is not in charge of the armed forces. I will run on Boko Haram Pang on your Lonnie Bono State. Baba Wani. Do you turn just get the woman? Commander in chief, who can fear one person still learning that he, oh, I know sure, Colomanjo, Shaku Shaku, Nibo Miro, Nibati, Jonathan Shay, Chibogo, condemn them, but Lord Johnny Cano, who got him on Bombo, Abuja, Kilo de Dawn, or I condemn Buhari, but Lord Joe, Skelew, me, a fire bomb. The animal fair came off with the perfect Boko Haram go end. And that is your Baba Tio Mongkonton Shekulombe. And that is the Fungu Ari. Fungu Ari goes from the S.O. Peto ba jekpo onshi yon gine. Go on ashe ju ba yi lo. But I'm far from where I'm at the day. Baba o ni go kon lo ke. Opo lo o shi she. No, if you react like that, I'm going to ask you to go to that way. Baba Tio Espire. That is your doom. In Koti, I'm going to analog brain. I want a brain. I want the I want digital brain. Oh, that big brain. Ki, I need the be earphone. I be I need the Android. I be Samsung S9. Kwa lomu Nokia 3300. Kwa mafiru nuri le de inche mafu ilempo wa rai sherai. Awo baba Nokia 3300 la wele yo. I need the Samsung S9. Ngota wa wa funi e. Ah, amo kwe iberepo. Repete. Awo mama wa. Oni ba ola shema ba wa wa bagba yenfa. Ti oh ni dojo kwa ruda ba dori oye. Aye vinya lefwa. Awa timba onfa onjo tipe. Ti eba bere la omo yinto wa luri gugu eni kongbe video wa ya di nineteen ninety three ba tawale ya biola. Awa la le a wolo kuko dori oye. 
awa la je ba tun le awon je kudu gera na kro lori oye the only place our Nigeria to Television, plasma TV, to design Facebook. Who are compared and the official ambassador to America, Nigeria, and say, Young boy, who are the same with the official ambassador to Nigeria, La America, Baba 82, ni. Lati Daru Kwara, Baba and Kauru Kwara, and he knew we took one possible Kauru Kwara, correct. So, and it's here about this, you want to be as you lay your bed, so also you lie on it. Anything about the jewelry, you know, man, determine be law because I want to man select the first level. And yeah, who we call our fellow say work up no more pay. I'm I like I feel on football that that. She tell me fellow say work up in 2019. She on deck by me lemon around lost it. The bat in on deck by me to my pay the work play. Eh, tell the qualifying me. In the last one she. I want Baba or the Bami to one now. No, 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 a toti a mua fui inu mi du pe oro wa ye ra wa inu mi du pe e gbo wa ye nkan ti mo fe so gbe ni pe loto le tin pade awon politician to n paro fun yin amo te ba ri won te ba te ba raun to n paro eyin na mo e o ba ni yin nitori e ti ri pe enu opuro ko kin seje Emo won te ba ri won ni ba ri tinu wa mo po ni ro ni te ba ri bu ari e mo po ni mo na fi kini te ba ti ri body judge e ti mo ro eyan to je te ba ra ti ku to je pe yawe e ko so wi pe ibi ton tin se fayawo na te pade ra won yawo to fe sile e ti mo pe awon eleyin o le tunun se o te ba ri ru awa to je pe lati e mo le kere waju yin amo Latin 1989, Latin Jaffa, Urilede, Latin University of Lagos, but she did with you, Dubai, that lost Lewe. 89, what did you do in 1987? What she jumped, language, what University of Latin 1980, what she stepped for the University of Lagos. It did not join in Lanja from Bill Rishimata. But boom, continue, most of the people, she lie, the Motisha Ella Lobby, that no penny show, and then to buy lost the University of Lagos. And to buy more, I pray, need. Ni ba June twelfth, we awo wulo droti abiola. Ni ba abiola njia from June twelfth droti. Ni ba abiola ku awala shoku abiola. Ojo tu ku in nineteen ninety eight. Ni ba tano we oba sonjo de tano yonte le ni ni mokero miti moku Nigeria because awati rojo la kwe awo ni ewa bad chendi. But kuzen da le ba so rumba eh oni kagben wa song. Enwe la wa si. Don't you think Bolo won't know?
Amor, you want to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the Well, <laughs> Uh, and it's about a way. It's one uh, mala only uh, um, first saw mala or no represent our area. Yes, one of us saw one or two things. Okay, uh -huh. so that mala, where is him? Okay, I have a full mind. Thank you. Our own problem, don't go say beyond mom, theater present, by the grace of God. First problem for Mata, the walk around. Yes. Walk around Mata. Yes, over. Do not stay for or not. We are wrong for everywhere. Some of us, they are wrong for Cameroon. Some people they don't call Lagos here. Mm. That's Boko Haram. Last two days, they don't go enter Mangono yes. or Bagadia. No past two days, I be three days to dinner. Yes. That's why we pray to that matter to set. How many years today? Almost 10 years for Boko Haram matter yes. in Nigeria. We know here in New York, only born not stay. Today, born not stay. Tomorrow, born not stay. We don't tire for that one. Our own to help us if we end up by grace of God, we go win. That's our own problem. Go for that matter. That's to stop us. Thank you. They kill our father, they kill our mother. All young, young boys, they're not there. Go in there. Some local start from Goza, Bama local Gama, Goza local Gama, go to. Grawa, no people. Go go share, no people. Go to bank side, no people. All the some areas, small small area, nobody. The place where army then there from Borno, come to Bama, come to Goza, Bruka, that's why place where army then there. The remaining area. Nobody. Nobody. All the Boko Haram see continue now. And then they see they kill people. That's our own problem. They help us. By the grace of God, we enter. They help us for them. Thank you very much. My name is Sandra Bukhara. All right. Thank you, Sandra. Thank you. Without wasting our time, I want to call on Honorable Bankole. He's one of the... Uh, he has been a uh, candidate for Agege, and uh, he's a veteran politician. Thank you very much, sir. AAC. 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 Show a for president. All right. Um, I'll be mixing it. Mama, Dad, Paul, Yoruba, Atoyubo, Tori Koishi, Yoruba, Nikolo, and Big. I'll be mixing it. And uh, I'll make it very straight, simple, and attractive. Mr. President, sir, I have a lot of things to talk about. But first, let me start with uh, uh, followers. Ajaki Berepeluawa, T. Anfe Manyo, Awo, Alashe Siko. More were disappointed in me by Lenny. More back what in the constituency, me I get one, but Mama saw it later. I just have two minutes to talk. Sherry Bobo Galak, Bobo Kimitanje, Kutia Yeke for Woko. If you want to hear the truth, if you like, hate me, it's none of my business. We came here for business. We came here for business. We said we want 
a change. Not the type of change we are being given like almost four years back. Share the time to walk by drinking at the Galai. It's a lawyer, Kekoni Koni soon. But yes, a big power lot. Yes, you look at me now, I'm looking big, right? But I can tell you where the shoe is pinching me. Ejo, Ejo can allow the corona. I have just two minutes. Awa go 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 ni problem wa Are you getting me now? I have a lot of things to tell you. There's no time. It is unfortunate he's not giving us the old day, Mr. President, sir. It is unfortunate. We'll come back. I contested primary election. I gave a constituency over. Somebody that has been there for four times, four times, is still going for the fifth time. Unfortunately, unfortunately, Bogba, I want you to uh, to your go support the youth. Do you know that they were going for crumbs? Atenuje, God bless you. They were going for 10,000, 5,000, 3,000. That person that are going for four times is the person that is following for the fifth time in the status of assembly. But let me now tell you this. Please, if we know that we are really serious about bringing or following the youth, that about no we put it sua. Ejo, along or bani mo fi bebubua. Ki bobo wato le fi le ta fi on le. Ta wa joko si bi bae. Ta fi waba, Mr. President, if you could look on. Glory be, am fe ki odor, kodi, are ori le de yi. We need to show more seriousness. Ejo ki fi yele. Mr. President, sir. The problem in this country is interwoven. Oti Bukon, Wala Elui, Tanko in Nigeria, Oti Bukon. I know you very well, though I have not met you before. I stand to be corrected. I want to believe you are the sole owner of uh, Sarah Reporter. I am a Sarah Reporter. Ori Sarah Reporter, let me take a presidential result in 2015. If you don't know, go and check it. Are you getting me? If you tell me to go and get people to win, Sarah reporter, look at me. If people to win, go to the Jonathan. Oh, congratulate you, Wari. Now, let's leave that. I've heard about your exploits. Moti Bomba, he shared the beauty, 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 most of your candidates I don't know in my local government, AAC, right from local government to state and to the federal level. I'm talking about state house of assembly uh, candidates, I'm talking about house of representative candidates, I'm talking about senatorial candidates and governorship candidates. I don't know them. And in my own opinion, Otuma Siwipe is a publicity of Tito talking about creating awareness. I get it, you have mentioned 10 points agenda. 10 points agenda. Sherry, sir, Mr. President, sir, the way you have mentioned it orally, that day, the last time we were together, daddy, the last time we were together, I mentioned Furarawa, Furarawa, Oyeka, Dawo, Job, Asoro, Mr. President, Kashi, Wepelebe. That if you create awareness, football bar, water bar, you will be able to shake me with big chocolate and so on and so on. When Governor Tinubu was contesting in 1999, to Shedon in 2003, there was a letter written to all citizens of Lagos. I don't know if it got to many of you. It got to me. I still have the record. Of everything he said he would do. He did not do everything, but he did most things in that letter. But he did most things in that letter. Oko letter. Oh, the passport photograph we see. Oh, the sign there. As in, MS. Oh, the distributors in the 20 local government. Mr. President, sir, you need to do something like that. Tell us. At first, I like the 10 point agenda. Break it down further. That. Bechefeche, 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 Lele. The truth must be told. Buari might be bad before, but he has good intention. Jonathan does not have a good idea of government, but he also has good intention. Just like you are coming now and you have good intention. As you call Rotito, cast soft rara, you to know she at the you to know she. But the truth must be told. Hawks are around you. T party A A C Y G. Taba your president in the court. Otoro le nika masong. Taba your president in the court. Tani other key positions. 
I am so sorry. We need to know how to work for all other key persons that we hold key positions. Governors, House of Representative members, senators, assembly members, all across the length of the breadth of the country. We need to know how to work on that. I am not ready to take money from you. I contested. I gave people money. Leaders that are youth in my local government, leader in me, Moloji Sumi, a Mino of Fellows Assembly. I want to make life better for citizens. Citizens are suffering. I am an entrepreneur by excellence. I am a realtor. God has blessed me. But because I cannot fight for people, people line up in the front of my door on a daily basis and ask for money. I am tired of doing that. Owo o dala ko eni kona. Owo ko dala. Owo de ni pari wo. E to ba lo wo nu abi bai. We will not know until you tell us you have money. Are you getting me now? Now we are talking about government. My sir, my Mr. President sir, before I will round up, there are three lists with which you use to run in the government. The first list is the exclusive list. The second list is the concurrent list, and the final list is the residual list. In the exclusive list, I want to continue federal government leadership to the state government. Because constitution will allow it. I want to go to your country left local government. Go local government. What you about what you want? Let me give you an example, sir. Oh, in a bell put up. It's back on my job, baby. Oh, that's a journey. Oh, move a mojuto. Oh, I don't know if you heard about it. Imagine the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria concerning himself with the title of Obership in Oru Kingdom in Adel Kuta, and that is in the local government from federal down to local. Are you getting me, sir? There are a lot of anomalies. The residual is state government, Omababa local government, Atumaba Wadu, Koto Yako Fila Fuwa. Money that is supposed to go to the local government for different kind of uh, 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 construction, road, health, education, and what have you. Now, local government chairman want to go and queue up. I don't know how you want to do it. Uh, I don't know, but we need a clear court analysis of how you want to do it. It must be very clear because I would ask questions. I want to still have a one-on-one -on -one with you, sir. God bless us. God bless Mr. President. Thank you. 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 We thank our Honorable and we thank our brother from the Northeast that spoke about Boko Haram. What I want to tell our brother who spoke about Boko Haram is that Boko Haram is not supposed to have lasted up to five years but it transmuted from a problem to a business and when a problem becomes a business in nigeria that people benefit from it can never end until you change the operators of the country we did it with buhari buhari clearly has run out of ideas that's why he must clear roads for us so that we can go and solve Boko Haram problem. I know how to solve Boko Haram problem. I covered Boko Haram since it started under Sahara reporters. All the revelation about how generals are stealing money came from Sahara reporters. In fact, the man that was killed by armed robbers or assassinated the other day, bad day, there was a time that his village was under attack. Instead of rescuing his village people, he sent helicopter to go and pick his dogs from his house. Yes. So, you know that sometimes when you want to sympathize with them, also think twice. You know, I won't say anything more than that because they are not supposed to speak evil of uh, the dead. But regarding what you are saying, there's nothing you want to tell me about the federal government and all the lists that I don't understand. I mean the exclusive, the concurrent and residual. All these things are supposed to be working. But when you have greedy people, managing anything what i want to say to you is that if you have if you give the whole world to a greedy man 
it can never satisfy him. And that is a mistake that Nigeria has been making. We are servicing the greedy and we are forgotten the needy. It is time to change that process around. And with regards to our party and its membership, don't forget AAC is three months old, but it's the fastest growing party today because of the leadership of the party and the way it's managing its agenda and its progress. Another thing that I want to tell you now, we say this is our party, this is our party where we start. Now only three months where we don't do. But nobody with the for Nigeria today we don't know our party, this is say some young people they more well, than not to worry about who will be senator but look now vote for correct senator. And I talked on before the way you they take some problem of representation, not be party before before. Now what they call Omoluabi. If that correct person, even the PDP, they could choose them to represent them. If it's the APC, I'm not conversing for other parties though, they could choose them. If it's the AAC, but the one where they're important right now are the presidency of the country of Nigeria. The president of Nigeria or the president of Nigeria is the most powerful position in Nigeria. If you don't get it right, you can have all the local governments under your control, you are wasting your time. You can have all the senators under your control as long as the president is not the right person. You are wasting your time. In fact, when Buhari was sick, he took the country to sickness with him. Yes. When Yaradwa was sick, Nigeria was sick until he died because of the presidency in such an important position. And that is how we can solve our problem. Not in any way, Honorable Discounting, as in the fact that we need to strengthen our party, and that is what we are doing today. One thing I will tell you, and you can go and check if any presidential candidate has ever been to Ojodu before. They will never come. They are not interested in you. They are not going to take your questions because they are not interested in answering even questions. Atiku will never come here. Buhari will never come here. But take it to the bank that you saw a presidential candidate who can rob minds with you. That is how other countries are doing it. After we win, and I'm sure we will win, yeah. we will still be coming and having this kind of community conversations so that you can be telling us what you need as opposed to we telling you what we think you need. Not sending people. Or sending people to you. There is nothing, and I say it with authority, that there's no big deal about constructing road in Akute to Ojodu. This has lasted for almost 20 years. Abba, that one you don't need concurrent lists or residual lists now. You just need the contractor to do the job. If I give you contract, you not do it, I'm a day for your neck. If you don't do it, you go to jail. That is where contractors, when no they do doing work, they go. This is the problem with Nigeria. We don't have leaders with character. And I will say one last thing. Though it will take all these people you mentioned to make this work, but it will take one person with character to set an example for the future. When they needed it in South Africa, they chose Nelson Mandela. When they needed that symbol in America, they chose Barack Obama. When we need it in Nigeria, you can never hear that one senator change America or one local government chairman. Yes, they make their efforts. It's the president of those countries that makes the most difference. If you go to India today, is the president of India. In the last five years, he has wiped out poverty from India. He has connected every village without electricity to electricity grid in the country. It's the work of the president. Whereas I agree with you that we need to strengthen, we have this conversation again, and we will come back and we will keep coming back. We don't want to dilute the message to our people. The message that is so clear today, that this is a historic day in the history of this meeting. Don't let it be that. And I don't want it to be lost on anyone, because one day you'll come back and say, I was there. 
when a discussion was had that changed the country of Nigeria in my lifetime. Hausa okay. okay. man was here today. He's not asking to vote for another Hausa man. Igbo person was here today. He's asking for a better Nigeria. Yoruba man was here today. He was asking not for Yoruba uh, general, but the country. I'm sure there are people from Badakri. I'm sure there are Ibibus in the house. Somebody even said he came from Kwara. Do you know why Lagos is very important? Every family is represented in this Lagos in Nigeria. So the moment we decide that this is how we are doing it in Lagos, it will go back and percolate back to every part of Nigeria. And I assure you again that everything I'm promising you here will be done. And I agree with you, Honorable. We'll do a letter. No question about it. But you know, in 2000 and uh, in 1999, you can write a letter to Lagosians. In 2018, you can send a WhatsApp to Lagosians. That is digital. So if you are not getting a physical letter, you will get a WhatsApp letter, a digital letter. Yes. And where we cannot reach you, through WhatsApp or physically, will reach you spiritually. <laughs> There's no going back to Egypt. We are free now. Thank you so much. Thank you, everybody. Eternal Raji, Bismillah, Rahman, Rahim. Allahumma salli ala Sayyidina Muhammadi. Mutorafu gubu wa kwata kwata. Atawata wa sibi bahino. Umotawano adi president. Amen. Elitoba ha shishi o nishi, o shishi arayin. I should share our one. Tabawa assisting or calling me. Any Konoluma assists our no Lola. Go over that she who better and better Nigerian along the Puri Bay, along the Bush Bay, who got a fair along the Bush. So, but Rafa could go along for a pata. I was a little lying in a shade and Rajim is like Raman and Rahim, along Loba Mole, the Moles in Nigeria. Oh, my little story. Oh, so bad, so bad, so bad, oh, she bad. Umulu <laughs>
it back. Action. Where's Barrow? Take it back. Barrow. Take it back. Action! 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 Action!